Google has been in fierce competition with other tech giants to enhance its AI capabilities. One of their significant moves was the introduction of Bard, an AI chatbot. But for a while, the Google Assistant seemed to be in the background, not getting the spotlight it deserved. They've supercharged the Google Assistant by integrating it with Bard, and it's a game changer. Let's look at how it works, and another exciting AI breakthrough from Google called Dinny Bar. Now, when you think of Google Assistant, you probably imagine a handy tool that responds to your voice commands. But with the addition of Bard, it's taken a giant leap forward. This upgraded version, introduced by Shia, a high-ranking Google executive, is a blend of the classic Assistant and Bard. It's more than just voice responses. It's a multi-talented assistant that can now understand images too. It's like having an assistant who can help you with everything, from planning your trips to creating fun captions for your Instagram photos. It's a whole new level of interaction, and it's pretty amazing. While this upgrade is still in its early stages, the potential is genuinely exciting. What is the potential for a Bard-powered assistant? The Bard-infused assistant isn't limited to processing only text and voice. It can also handle image queries, responding in text or voice depending on the context. Initially, it's exclusively available for mobile devices, and you won't find it on smart speakers just yet. It's somewhat of a VIP experience, reserved for approved Android users. You might see it as a full-screen app or an overlay, similar to the current assistant interface. If you're an iPhone user, it's expected to integrate seamlessly within one of Google's apps. Google isn't the only player in this arena. Amazon's Alexa has become more conversational, and OpenAI's ChatGPT is also exploring multimodal capabilities. But Google's approach seems to have an edge. It can engage in a meaningful conversation about the web page you're currently browsing, which can be incredibly handy on your smartphone. What else makes Bard different? But what's particularly cool is how Bard assists the assistant in understanding images. Imagine this scenario. You take a snapshot of a stylish pair of sneakers or a classic painting and feed it to the assistant. Unlike in the past, where Google Lens might merely identify the item or try to sell it to you, the new assistant comprehends the context of those images. This feature can be invaluable in various situations, whether you're shopping or trying to learn more about something you've stumbled upon on social media. For example, you come across a picture of a dreamy hotel on Instagram, and with a simple tap, you can ask the assistant to gather more information about the hotel or check its availability on your birthday weekend, and it gets done seamlessly. Similarly, if you spot a product you fancy, just take a picture and ask the assistant to find it online for you. While commercial listings aren't integrated yet, Google hasn't ruled it out for the future. Their focus is on evolving the assistant to meet users' real needs, rather than just making a quick profit. It's all about enhancing your experience. What is the technology behind this new upgrade? Now, delving into the technical side of things, the enchantment behind this remarkable advancement lies in the flourishing world of large language models. These models have truly transformed how AI comprehends both text and speech, resulting in more natural and intuitive interactions with voice assistants. However, it's vital to acknowledge that, despite the awe-inspiring progress in this tech, it's not without its set of challenges. One significant concern revolves around ensuring that AI remains free from potentially harmful biases, which can sneak in, especially when dealing with voice-based interactions. Moreover, this upgrade introduces the possibility of more personalized interactions by delving into your emails or documents to provide tailored responses. This, while incredibly exciting, raises valid concerns regarding data privacy and security. But there are other innovations in the field of AI from Google, too. It's a delicate balancing act, seeking to offer a super-intelligent assistant while safeguarding the privacy of user data. In the grand scheme of things, this upgrade serves as a glimpse into the thrilling AI-driven transformation that lies on the horizon. As this technology matures, who knows? It might revolutionize how we engage with the digital world, making our lives more convenient and, dare I say, a tad more fun. Now let's turn our focus to another remarkable innovation from Google. Allow me to kick off with a question. Have you ever yearned for your smartphone to perform Hollywood-style video effects? Well, Google's latest tech marvel, Dinny Bar, is here to fulfill that wish. This ingenious tool empowers you to freeze time, gracefully maneuver your camera, 
or create slow motion effects, all from a single video captured on your smartphone. How does DiniBar work? DiniBar, which stands for Neurodynamic Image-Based Rendering, is a groundbreaking method highlighted in a paper honored at CVPR 2023. It opens the door to the world of photorealistic free viewpoint renderings, achievable from a single video of a complex, dynamic scene. DiniBar ushers in a whole new realm of video effects, introducing the enchantment of bullet time effects, where time seems to come to a standstill as the camera gracefully orbits a scene. From a single video captured on your phone, it delivers video stabilization, depth of field adjustments, and the magic of slow motion effects. This technology marks a significant leap in video rendering, particularly for intricate, moving scenes, clearing the path for captivating video editing applications. The excitement doesn't stop there. The code for DiniBar has been generously shared with the public, inviting everyone to dive into its capabilities and explore its potential. DiniBar solves a major problem. At the core of this innovation lies a challenge frequently grappled with by videographers, the 4D scene reconstruction problem. When it comes to capturing dynamic elements such as people, pets, or vehicles, Traditional view synthesis methods often yield blurry and imprecise renderings. This is where DiniBar steps in with a fresh approach to rendering. Unlike the prior dynamic neural radiance fields, NERF methods that try to fit the complete scene's appearance and geometry into a complex neural network, DiniBar opts for a more streamlined solution. It exclusively stores the motion, resulting in a smoother and less intricate data structure. DiniBar makes a clever move by forgoing the necessity to accumulate every scene detail within an extensive neural network. Instead, it directly utilizes pixel data from nearby input video frames to create fresh perspectives. It builds upon an image-based rendering, IBR method, such as IBRNet, which was originally designed for static scenes. The core principle of IBR methods, including IBRNet, hinges on the idea that a new target view of a scene should closely resemble nearby source images. This resemblance allows the synthesis of the target view by dynamically selecting and warping pixels from neighboring source frames, eliminating the need for a comprehensive pre-reconstruction of the entire scene. Of the How does rendering work with DiniBar? To bring image-based rendering or IBR into the realm of dynamic scenes, DiniBar takes a unique approach by incorporating the motion of the scene during the rendering process. It tackles the movement of every 3D point within a scene, representing this motion with a motion trajectory field encoded through a multi-layer perceptron, or MLP. This rendering method, however, comes with its set of challenges, given that reconstructing and generating new views for a complex moving scene is a highly intricate problem with a multitude of potential solutions. To delve further into the input video, DiniBar introduces a concept known as cross-time rendering a technique that delivers high-quality results. It achieves this by utilizing the state of a 4D representation at one specific time moment to render images that correspond to a different time instance, ensuring a coherent flow over time. To enhance the fidelity of the rendering process, DiniBar automatically dissects the scene into static and dynamic components. These components are modeled through time-invariant and time-varying scene representations, respectively. As we conclude this exciting journey through the world of Google's BARD-powered assistant and the remarkable DiniBar technology, we hope you've been inspired by the boundless possibilities of AI and machine learning. From enhanced digital interactions to cinematic creativity at your fingertips, these innovations hint at a future where your smartphone becomes an even more powerful tool.